Today's Turning Point with David Jeremiah, the saint in sunshine, and have no fellowship with the unfruitful works of darkness, but rather expose them, Ephesians 5.11. The last half of Paul's letter to the Ephesians revolves around the idea of walking. We're to walk worthy of calling with which we are called, 4.1, to walk in love, 5.2, to walk as wise, 5.15, and to walk in the light, Ephesians 5.8 says, for you were once darkness, but now you are light in the Lord. Walk as children of light. Recommended reading is Ephesians 5, 8 through 14. That means we're to avoid doing things that people do in darkness, in moral and spiritual darkness. Our world is a dark place and loathsome creatures thrive in darkness. Pornography, cheating, profanity, compromise, fearfulness, anxiety, depression, unrestrained anger, and personal bitterness. We may be in the world, but we are not of the world. We can't help it. People around us are wrapped up in things of this world and the darkness. We must love them and minister to them. We cannot be partakers with them. Visualize yourself today wrapped in a blanket of light. You'll be a saint in sunshine. You will walk in sunshine. The Lord will be your everlasting light and your God your glory. Reverend James Fleming Our Father in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Make each day the best it can be. Put a smile on someone else's face.